Well, hello there. It's that time again. Yes, it is. It is time for our weekly tarot and astrology reading here on this lovely Sunday evening of May the 9th of 2021. As usual, I'm going to go over some Tarot de Marseille trump cards as they're displaying what is coming up for us this week. And then we'll take a look at some astrology, which, as usual, is very interesting. So, please do stay tuned. Okay, in a moment, three Tarot de Marseille trump cards are going to come onto the screen and cover my face. The cards I drew at random for this week's reading are the Fool, the Emperor, and the Hanged Man. Well, our Fool is a Fool. He is trudging along, uh, carrying his worldly possessions over his shoulder, as a dog or cat-like creature paws at him whether it's spurring him on or whether it is trying to restrain him is sort of a matter of opinion. But the fool can be very eccentric. The fool can be just raw foolishness. But he's being stopped by the wand of the emperor. The emperor saying, no, you don't come this way. You are restrained. I rule you. Because I don't want to be like this fellow behind me, the hanged man. The foolishness of the hanged man leads to that state of being hung out to dry. Now, what's interesting here is that the strength card to me tends to represent self-restraint with this woman holding a lion's mouth. Here we have a sense of restraint coming from an external authority or external force. So we may find ourselves this week being stopped from doing something that we think is good and it's coming from something outside of us, whether it's circumstances or literally an authority like a government figure or superior person in employment, what have you. We're going to have that stoppage, but this is actually perhaps in our very best interest. So it's going to be interesting to see how this reading is going to play out this week as it progresses. Now looking at our astrology, we do have a new moon coming up here in two days on the 11th of May at 3 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We are going to have a full moon in Taurus. Very nice. Uh, the moon is very happy in the sign of Taurus. It's exalted in that sign. So this is a potent new moon. New moons are beginnings. A chance to plant Seeds. Taurus is a sign of fertility. So this is a very, very good time for planting seeds. It's kind of unfortunate that that day the moon is going to be squaring Jupiter, applying a square. This is a very uneasy aspect, very full of tension. So not the greatest time, unfortunately, for a real full-blown abundance spell, money spell. But still, still planting those seeds for whatever it is that we want whether it does be abundance or uh, health, uh, anything that we want to bring to us, love, whatever it is that we need, this will be a good time to plant those seeds for this to happen. Then on Wednesday, the moon is going to be in a good aspect to planet Mercury on the day that it rules. So this too is going to be good for healing, for commerce, for magic in general, learning, yes. Those activities will be blessed. This next two weeks are indeed a time for manifestation. Well, there you go. There is your weekly tarot and astrology reading. I love you very much. I thank you for tuning in. Till I see you next week, many, many blessings.